Hey everyone! <laughs> so um, today it's 42 degrees here in Melbourne, Australia and um, my brother and I are off to go and get some McDonald's for lunch. Um, don't know why <laughs> but we are just hungry and it's the sixth day into the year and we are already doing ourselves a disservice but it's fine. Um, I feel like I'm going to crave it forever if I don't get it today. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, um, he nodded his head. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to vlog me going through the drive through and everything like that, I think. And I'm just going to get a lot of things. So see you there. Hey everyone, so I switched over to my normal camera, my big camera. So, I've got fries, there's some in here. I swear. I got chicken burger. I mean, <laughs> I got a cheeseburger. I got myself some nuggets. Oh, they gave me sweet and sour sauce. I didn't even ask for that. Yeah, I thought I would just sit here and eat with you. Why not? <laughs> so, it's so hot. I don't know what to start with, actually. Maybe I'll just start with the nugs. So, it's boiling here. Like, the trip to Macca's was just a trip. Like, a trip. It was so hot. Our air conditioning doesn't even work properly in the car, so it's just, like, a mess. So, I heard that there's, like, blizzards and stuff in New York. That's, like, crazy compared to here. What? Isn't it crazy how like the weather is just completely opposite? Mmm, this sauce is good. I don't know about you, but I hate it when people talk with their mouth full when they're doing these videos. I'm sad that I only got three nuggets, but it's okay. So I have two really exciting videos coming up to do with like American food. And I know that most of you guys love those videos and I love filming them, so I'm going to film more. <laughs> I'm just waiting for the food to arrive because I ordered them online. And they take about a week to get here, so yeah. I'm just excited about that and I hope you guys will enjoy it. Did anyone hear about the Fosters being cancelled, the TV show? I'm so sad because I was just waiting for the... Um, second half of season five to come. So excited, ready for like 10 seasons. And then they, I think like two characters are getting a spin-off. So I think Callie and Mariana are getting their own spin-off. I'm excited to see how that goes actually, because I really like Mariana's story. I'm not a fan of Callie's story, but I'll watch it. But yeah, I just looked at my Instagram one morning and there it was, they are canceling it after I think it's either one like really long episode or three like normal sized episodes and then they're just stopping it. So I'm sad about that. Yeah, I don't know what people talk about when they film these videos. The food is so good. I've missed it. I don't think I've had McDonald's in a long time. I've had KFC and stuff in between. I think like at McDonald's would be really different in other countries like especially the US compared to Australia and like the UK and stuff and Asia just because I've seen on YouTube like a lot of people doing like McDonald challenges I don't know why I keep saying like and it's just really interesting to see so comment below if you're one of those foreign countries and or any foreign country actually because it's so interesting to see like how different people's food is from us because I know it's different obviously on to 
So I've eaten like most of my fries. <laughs> um, on to chicken and cheese. So I'm not a big fan of chicken and cheese, but they used to do this really cheap burger, which was really good. It was, what was it? Chicken and mayo. So it's basically the same as a chicken and cheese, but it has no cheese and it has lettuce. So it's a bit healthier. Um, and it still has mayo in it, and I love the mayo that they use in Maccas. I don't know what it's filled with, but it makes me happy. Yeah, so I'm moving on to this just because I want to save the cheeseburger till last because the cheeseburger is my favorite. I really like the way that they package these. Could be a bit nicer. <laughs> so this is what my chicken and cheese looks like. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> oh, so good. Mmm. So I've been re-watching Vampire Diaries lately, and I've never watched the, like, the later seasons. I think I watched one episode of the later seasons, but that's it. Um, I stopped watching when something really big happened, and um, it wasn't really like the same for me anymore, but I'm just excited to watch again and see if I can change my mind, um, because I love the show. And it ended last year, so. All the seasons are out now, so that's good. So since it's like really hot, it's like, what's the, what's the weather now? It's 39 degrees Celsius. So it's supposed to like the high is supposed to be 42, which is supposed to reach, like it's supposed to reach 42 at three o'clock in the afternoon, which is scary. And then tomorrow's only supposed to be 22. But yeah, tomorrow's only supposed to be 22. Mm. I hate sleeping when it's hot weather, do you? Like, I hate it so much. Um, I never normally sleep without the doona on, like the big blanket. I don't know what you guys call it over in America. Oh, no, they call it duvet. Duvet? I don't know. We call it a doona. Um, and I could only sleep with the sheet. And I never ever normally do that because I think like a monster's gonna get me or like a ghost is gonna consume me if I have the doona off. But I did it and I braved it last night. Also, what's really annoying about my room is because I have to have the window open if I want some air in here because I don't think we slept with the air conditioning on so I have like a vent like on the roof and I have my window over there and then my door's over here like this way and um the door rattles I don't know if you can hear it but it's doing it now and it must be like something's like loose in the door or something and it's just really annoying when you're trying to get to sleep and you cannot <laughs> So last night I watched Picked Perfect 3 and it was really, really good. Like, I'd say like 9.8 out of 10. I think the second one was really good. I loved the first one, obviously, because I've gone back and seen all the movies. So I think I might watch 1 and 2 today. A couple of weeks ago now, I've just finished my chicken and cheese. I didn't think I'd actually be able to finish that. Let's go back onto some fries. Um, <coughs> I just dropped one. Um, a couple weeks ago, or like last week, like early last week, I went to go see Jumanji. Really good. Like, a lot different from the first one. I feel like the first one was like a lot darker and a lot more intense, but the second one is a lot more like light-hearted, light-hearted and um, really good. I think like younger kids would like it a lot more than they'd like the first one, like nowadays, if you get what I'm saying. like. The first Jumanji scared me, like I'd be scared to watch it. But no I'm not. We went to go see it in Gold Class, myself and my boyfriend. We had dinner before that. <laughs> There's a ghost in my house. We went to go have dinner before that, we had like Vietnamese. And we thought we were being so healthy and then we got into Gold Class and they were having this deal. And it was like two desserts for thirty dollars, and their desserts are only like twenty dollars each. So two for thirty is pretty good. So we got churros and a, which came with like ice cream and dipping sauce, and then we got a waffle, like a salted caramel waffle with like, um, with like salted caramel popcorn and stuff, and uh, what they have like caramel sauce and like ice cream on top. And if you don't know what Gold Class is, this one franchise that's called Village Cinemas here in Australia, um, 
they do gold class cinemas so you get like it's a smaller cinema so there's maybe like 12 sets of two chairs like in the cinema and um, you get like waitress like service if you know what I mean so if you like you can order um, you can order your food before you because they have like this lounge that you can sit at and you have like a menu and stuff and you can order things for in the movie so if you want it at the start in the middle or at the end um, which is really cool why would you want it at the end though we got it at the start um, it's a bit expensive though let me just pick out the pickles because I don't like the pickles. I've always wondered if, um, like, foreign countries' McDonald's, like, the burgers look the same as ours. So this is what the cheeseburger looks like. So, <laughs> this is inside. Oh, hello! What does it look like? The hamburger. You know, that character that they had in, um, McDonald's? Anyway, so it has, like, the ketchup and the onions and stuff like that. And the mustard and cheese and stuff. And it's just so good. A cheeseburger is typically what you'd get um, if you went out, like after a night out on the town um, and you were like drunk. <laughs> on the way home you'd get this. And it's something just so quick and easy. Might not be the most nutritious thing but it tastes damn good and it really just like satisfies your cravings. Satisfies? Mm. I'm taking way too long to eat. Oh bye. I hope this is lit a day to get in. <laughs> Show your hand. <laughs> I'm all done. Nothing left. All all the burgers done. All the nuggets done. <clears throat> and that's gonna be like my last McDonald's <laughs> thing until next week. Watch me next week. No, I'm just kidding. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me eat. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below. And I hope that you guys tune in for my next American um, themed videos. This was not American themed. It was just kind of showing you what American McDonald's is compared to maybe your country. And Austra Australian McDonald's. What did I say? American. I'm done in America. I hope this gave you a bit of insight into what Australian McDonald's is compared to your country, whatever that may be. And if you did like this video, please tell me in the comments. <laughs> and yeah, I hope to see you in my next video. Bye!